Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Attention, may I have your attention, please? We are going to announce the winners of the yearbook categories. Most fashionable. Oh, this is gonna be me, I just know it. Ugh, lame, who cares about the yearbook? I'm totally gonna win everything when I get out of high school. Yeah, sure you will, sure. <laughs> Most friendly, all of that. Most fashionable, Brookie. Say what? Congratulations, Brookie, that's amazing. Thanks, Molly. Whoa, I never thought I'd get most fashionable. But I guess I do wear a lot of dog shirts, and people love dogs. Smartest. Oh, this is definitely going to be me because, hello, I have my own secret science lab. I get A's in everything. Brookie. What? Brookie? Okay, well, I'm not going to be jealous. Um, I just, okay, congratulations, Brookie. Whoa, why am I winning everything? This is so weird. Next category, most popular. Obviously, this one makes sense because we did it by votes in the school. So, who got picked the most? Brookie. Say what? Now I know this thing is just totally wrong because I'm obviously most popular. Holy guacamole. I've, I've gotten like every single one. Yeah, tell me about it. Um, I'd like to win one thing. Student who loves lunch the most. Oh, this is me. Totally gonna be me. Brookie Cookie. And that concludes our category winners for this year's yearbook. Holy guacamole, Brookie, you won every category. I never knew you were so popular in school. Neither did I. I feel like such a loser. Yeah, I do too. Oh, nonsense, guys. I'm sure it's not a big deal. It's a total big deal. You won every category in the yearbook this year. Whatever. This school is so lame. I don't even care. Are you mad at me, Daisy? How could I be mad? Just a little disappointed is on. Well, there's the bell. Time to get out of here. What a weird day. Hey, Brookie, I heard you won every single category in the yearbook this year. Oh, hey, Chaz. Um, yeah, totally. Um, well, uh, I was wondering if you want to go to the school dance with me because I'm the most popular boy in the school and it seems like you're the most popular girl, so it just makes sense. Say what? Chaz, the most popular boy in school, is talking to Brookie? Oh, no. This means she'll stop talking to me because I'm not popular or cool or fashionable or smart or... Gosh, she didn't even win the category for likes to eat lunch and that's my favorite subject. I've got to do something about this before before I lose my best friend. Aha! I have an idea. It's going to work perfectly. Hey, Brookie, um, uh, do you want to take the bus home with me or walk? So, Chaz, um... Yeah, I think I'd love to go to the dance with you. Brookie? Who's this loser talking to you? Huh, what? Oh my gosh, she really doesn't even know I exist already. Oh, I better enact my plan and quit. I hope this works. This has to work. Hey, Brookie, good morning. Oh, hi, Molly, good morning. Oh, you actually noticed I existed today, huh? What? What are you talking about? And are you wearing the same exact outfit as me? Um, yeah. What a weird coincidence, huh? Yeah, totally. I just got this at the mall, like, last week. <laughs> Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Oh. Um, okay, well, I'll see you in class, Brookie. Sounds good, Molly. Daisy, what are you doing? Are you cleaning the floors? Molly, I just realized I'm not going to be a famous scientist. I'm not going to cure diseases or, or even help anyone on this planet with my scientific discoveries. I couldn't even win smartest.
assistant, Blue Cave, and I. So you're mopping the school floors? I figured I needed a job, and this pays minimum wage. I'm never going to make my dreams come true. Has the whole world gone insane over this? Not insane, Molly. It's just the reality of life. I... I'm a loser! Aww. Oh, boy, I better get to class before I'm late. Brookie, I see your hand raised. What? Brookie raised her hand? I'm going to raise my hand, too. Oh, my gosh, Molly, your hand is raised? That's the first time ever. Okay, Molly, why don't you go ahead and answer number four? Wait, what, what, what was the question? Oh, boy. Mrs. Smith, I'll just answer it, please. It's 659. Great job, Brookie. Oh, man, I'm failing at copying Brookie. How will I ever be popular now? Oh, look at all that delicious food. I want to eat everything. Hey, I should follow what Brookie does. She ate banana. Wait, she only ate a banana and she... She got most excited to eat lunch? That doesn't even make sense! At least she saved my seat. Oh, man. Chaz is sitting in my seat. She really doesn't love me anymore. And this banana is not what I want for lunch. Ugh. Hey, Brookie. Oh, I see you're eating super healthy for lunch. That's awesome. Yeah, I always eat super healthy. <laughs> it's just sort of my thing. Ah, oh, boy. This table needs fixing. Daisy, would you snap out of it? You you don't have to fix everything. I do, Molly. It's my lot in life now. Hey, Brookie. Oh, hey, Molly. What are you doing? I'm just sitting here eating a banana. Since when do you eat a banana? <laughs> That's what I mean. What are you doing? You normally eat pizza, drink soda. Well, I'm turning over a new leaf. Besides, you like bananas, right? Yeah, I love bananas. They're so good for you. Uh, now I'm going to go do my makeup in the bathroom and head to class. Seriously, that's all you're going to eat for lunch? There's so many more delicious things. I'm full, Molly. Um, okay. I guess I need to do my makeup too. Molly, you don't wear makeup. <laughs> what are you talking about? No, no, I'm going to do my makeup. Whoa, Brookie, you look beautiful. How do I look? Um, uh, Molly, I think you might have used a little bit too much mascara. Oh, <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, well, I've never used mascara before. Molly, what is going on with you? You're doing a lot of things you don't normally do, like wear the same outfits as me, eat the same lunch as me, put on makeup very badly, and why aren't you just being you? Because me is not good enough. What? What are you talking about? I have to be like you because you won everything at school, which means you're going to be super popular. I mean, even Chaz wants to pay attention to you and take you to the dance, which means you're going to forget all about me and our friendship. What? I would never forget about you, Molly. Not ever. You're my best friend. Just because I won everything at the yearbook doesn't mean that you should be like me. You should be yourself. Myself stinks. No one likes me. That's not true. I think you're amazing. You do? Yeah, even with your crazy mascara. May I have your attention, please? This is your principal, and I'd like to correct a mistake that I made yesterday. Apparently, there was a glitch in our computer system, and it tallied the yearbook categories incorrectly. Oh. Wait, what? Yeah, what? I'm going to read off the winners of each category. Most fashionable, Anna. Oh, wow, yeah, I could see that coming. What? I'm not the most fashionable, but, but I thought I was. Smartest in the whole school, Daisy. What? I don't have to unclog the boys' toilets anymore? I can go back to being my scientist self? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Today's a good day to be alive. And last but not least, student who loves lunch the most. <laughs> the school lunch lady will be so proud. Molly! What? I won? <laughs> I knew me eating lunches all the time, every day, all day at school would definitely pay off. <laughs> I can't believe it. I didn't win anything. I'm a loser! Well, if it makes you feel any better, I was a loser too. But you hated being a loser! Um, 
Yeah, but you're still my bestie, Brookie. I've got to go find Chaz. I mean, we're supposed to go to the dance together. Okay, well, good luck with that. Chaz? There you are. So, we're still going to the dance together, right? Wait, who are you? Okay, students, I forgot one of the categories. Most popular goes to Sarah. Um, I'm going to be taking Sarah to the dance. What? Oh my gosh, I really am the biggest loser! <laughs> Uh-oh, this isn't good. Rookie? Okay, just calm down. I can't believe I'm such a loser! <laughs> Rookie? Okay, she definitely needs to go to the school nurse. Okay, just move along, losers. I don't want you near me. And, uh, what happened to your eyes? It's makeup! Don't worry, Brookie. You're gonna go lay on the magic cot in the nurse's office, and everything's gonna be better. No! I can't believe it! I didn't win anything! Oh, well, next year, just eat way, way, way more pizza at lunch, and you can be the reigning champion of eating lots of school lunches. I just found out I don't have to be a school janitor. Oh, this has been the weirdest day ever! Marley, are you so excited to have ballet class again? Yeah, I'm totally excited. Marley, you're going the wrong way. What are you doing? I have to go in the grocery store. Marley, that's not where the ballet lessons are. Ooh, Doritos. Marley, shouldn't you eat something healthy beforehand? Mm hmm. Like a Dorito. Molly, that's not healthy! How about an apple to fuel you? Okay, I'll eat the apple, but I have to eat the Doritos first. Mm. So good! Molly, you need to have a drink and be hydrated, and also maybe an apple would do you good! Oh, she's so bossy. Okay, how about this? I I've got some perfect fruit to eat. Very good, Molly. Mm. Molly, that's not fruit, that's a donut! Correction, Daisy. It's a blueberry donut, so technically it's fruit. No, it's not, Molly. A blueberry donut is horrible for you. Now go eat some real fruit. What are you talking about? Blueberry on top of this is blueberry, right? No, it's probably not real blueberry cheapos. All I want to do is eat something that tastes delicious. Why you always got to be so mean? I just want to eat some Doritos. Molly, it's just because I love you. You really need to eat healthy. <laughs> I just want to eat a donut. Leave me alone. <laughs> Molly, you're totally faking right now. Okay, yeah, maybe a little. Okay, fine. I will eat a banana. Is that better? Mm. I actually don't mind bananas. That's better, Molly. Now, come on. We're already late for dance. You got to have proper fuel before you go to dance class. Daisy, look both ways, duh. Someone might have just run you over. Well, I had to get to dance class. <laughs> yeah, I know, but you can't get there if you're dead. Look both ways. Wow, and you said that I told you what to do a lot. Hey, guys, I was wondering you and you were going to show up. You're kind of late. And ballerinas are never late. Sorry, we had to stop and eat donuts and chips. Molly? Okay, well, I had a banana too, so, you know, I balanced it out with something healthy. Ugh, Molly, I think you should start eating a more healthy diet. Maybe, but not right now. And one, and two, and three, and four. Very good, Daisy. Dance is our passion. We love it. That's what the poster says anyway. And one, and two, and three, and four. Molly, are you seriously eating a donut in the dance studio while you're doing your, your ballet lesson? Um, nope. You're just, you're imagining it. Ah, donuts. So delicious. Molly! Okay, fine. No donuts. But would you mind if I ate some of these Doritos? Molly, you just ate something. Yeah, Molly, you just ate something, right? Hey, everybody. Oh, guys, welcome my new student, Sarah. What? Sarah? Sarah, you like ballet? Well, maybe. 
If I can stay away from you losers. We're not losers. We're amazing ballerinas. See? Can you do that? Can you do that? Yeah, I can do it a million times better than you, actually. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Let's see it. Yes, Sua. No one can peel wet like my sister. Um, except for maybe Sarah. That's right. <laughs> you think you're so good, but you're not. I always thought that I was really good. I, I'm, I'm confused. I mean, I, I, I've always been one of the best ballerinas around. Not compared to me. I could spin like this for hours. You're just a bad ballerina. What? A bad ballerina? S -s Seriously? <laughs> that makes me so sad. Marty, show her your hip hop moves. You're super good at that. Oh, yeah. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Whatever. That's like the easiest hip hop move ever. I'll show you how I do it. <laughs> so much better. Whoa, Molly, she's got a point. She's really good at it. Wait, what? No, y y you can't be good at it. Okay, well, can you do this? Let's twist again. Let's twist again. I can also do backflips. Oh, yeah, well. Ah, why is everybody just saying mean things like that I can't do it as good as you can? Molly, she, d she said that I did it. I can do a backflip, see? I can do a backflip, too. Yeah, well, I'm a much better dancer than you are. Oh, my gosh. I should have eaten so many donuts. Oh, I don't feel so good. Marley, just stop doing the backflips. But if I stop doing them, then she wins. I already won. I'm a much better dancer than you'll ever be. <laughs> Wait a minute. Am I at the news station? Who cares? I'll just stay here. <laughs> And we're on air in three, two, one, rolling. Wait a minute. Has anyone ever seen this news anchor before? Huh? What? Breaking news. Here we're with our new news anchor. Uh, what's your name? Uh, uh, m m m m m m Molly. That's right. We're here with Molly and she's wearing her dance uniform. I don't really know why, but she's going to tell us the news. The news is that, that I, uh, I'm... I'm a terrible dancer! <laughs> and I just wanted to be a great ballerina, and I'm not a great ballerina! And it was it! Uh, who hired this news anchor? Uh, she's losing her mind on TV. I don't know why Sarah always calls me a loser, and I just feel so sad! Okay, let's get her out of here. Come on, let's go out of this, out of here. What? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to take over your, your news station. It's just close to the dance studio. I needed a place to cry by myself. <laughs> Molly? Molly, where are you? She just humiliated herself in front of everyone on public television. Pretty sure she's never going to come back to a dance class ever again. Oh my gosh, I've got to hide. Okay, where could I hide? Where could I hide? Okay, I'll just hide behind this cabinet over here. No one will ever see me. Molly, where are you? Molly? Ma Molly, I see you. What are you doing? You don't see me. I'm hiding! Molly, I'm standing right next to you! I don't care, you still can't see me! Molly, what is going on with you? I mean, I sort of know. She said I was a terrible dancer, and I'm not as good as she is! Molly, you are as good as she is. Yes, Sarah's a great dancer, but she's also rude! And you're not rude, well, most of the time you're nice, and that counts for something. I don't know, I just, I feel sad because... I, I wasn't expecting her to be able to bully me about my dancing because I'm so good at it. You're still really good at dancing, Molly. It's just Sarah wants to, you know, make you feel like you're not because she's mean like that. But you can't let her win. Now come back to the dance studio and be your beautiful dance yourself. Yeah, you're right. Why would I let her win? Exactly, Molly. Now come on. I'm the best dancer in the world. Sarah, you should try to be more humble. I'm going to dance like I love to dance. My whole heart loves to dance. Wow, Molly, that's amazing. Not as amazing as me. Actually, Molly is an amazing dancer. You both are. You don't have to be in competition with one another. That's right. I only care about my own dancing and making myself the best that I can be. 
That's a great attitude to have, Molly. You get a special star today for being an amazing student. Really? Do I get a star? No, Sarah, you were rude to the other dancers. You don't get a star. <laughs> That's amazing! Daisy, wait for me, Jeepers. Why are you running so fast? Because Molly, I want to get home and watch my favorite TV show. I knew I shouldn't have eaten that last cupcake at lunch. Oh, my stomach hurts. Molly, you ate like 10 cupcakes. Why? You knew you'd get a stomach cake. Well, because they're so good. <laughs> oh, brother. Well, time to go watch my favorite TV show. Can I watch it too, Daisy? No, you annoying sister. What? No, I'm not. Take that back. No, kill an oiking, kill an oiking. What's this? Brookhaven Beach? Why is that on? Um, because apparently the cleaning lady thinks it's okay to just sit around and watch TV on our dollar. Look at all of this mess. I mean, seriously, it is so messy. There's a lot of dust bunnies around here. What? What are you talking about? I'm not a cleaner. Oh, you must be our new babysitter. I'm Daisy. This is Molly. I don't need a babysitter. I'm way too old for a babysitter. Why would Dad hire a babysitter? Well, Molly, I mean, maybe he just thought we'd like to have a friend when he's not home. Uh, I don't need friends. I've already got one. Her name is Brookie. And, well, you're my sister, so I guess you're sort of my friend. No, I'm not, Molly. You're annoying. Daisy, stop saying I'm annoying. Well, new babysitter, uh, you can make up all the rules that you want, but my sister Molly here is a rule breaker. She'll spend most of her time in a room being grounded. No, I won't. I'm not a rule breaker. When was the last time you did your homework, Molly? Um, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, probably about three months ago, right? Well, um, but I don't need to do homework. I'm super smart. I can pass all the tests without homework. Uh-huh, sure you can. What are you guys jibber-jabbering about? Pff, I'm not even your babysitter. Well, then why did you break into our house? If you're not a babysitter and you're not the cleaner, uh, you can't just come into someone's house and just, like, chill out on their couch and watch Brookhaven Beach or whatever. Um, I was invited here. <sighs> Maybe we should just wait to talk until your dad gets home. You know my dad? What, do you work with him or something? Yeah, what are you doing in our house is basically what we're saying. Hello, I'm home. Oh, there's my girls. Dad, there's there's somebody that knows you that's sitting on our couch, but I think she might be lying. I think she might be a burglar. Well, that's silly, Molly. Why would she get caught? She's just sitting here watching TV. Oh, <laughs> you girls are hilarious. <laughs> I thought I would get home before you and explain the whole thing, but you made me home from school. Um, okay, well, what is going on? If she's a house cleaner, she needs to get fired. No, girls, this is Haley, and she's your, um, well, new stepmom. Wait, what? What are you talking about, Dad? That's not a funny joke. Yeah, it's totally, totally true. I'm your new stepmom. <laughs> yeah, that's super funny. No, you're not. Um, girls, I, I want you to meet Haley. She's the new love of my life. What? Are you, have you gone insane, Dad? No, I'm serious. Isn't she so nice and so beautiful and fashionable? Dad, you don't care about fashion. What are you talking about? Has an alien taken over your brain? What? No, I, I'm just saying. I, I love Haley, and, well, she's your new stepmom. Um, okay. I need a minute. I'm kind of in shock. I am too. My stomach is hurting. Well, girls, Haley is really nice, and and I I want you guys to really get along. Yeah, I think I think we're gonna be really great friends, and well, <laughs> I'm also gonna be your stepmom, of course. But I want us to be friends. Um, okay, well, yeah, I, I guess. Uh, but you know, friendships take time to to develop and stuff, so it's probably gonna be a little while. I'm sure you and Haley are going to get along great, Molly. Well, it seems like you like fashion, so I like that about you. Yeah, I love fashion. Maybe I could help you rearrange your closet or something. What was your name again? Her name's Daisy. If you're going to be our stepmom, you at least need to remember our names. I'm Molly. And I'm Daisy. Oh, yeah, that's right. Daisy and Molly. No, I'm Molly. She's Daisy. 
Oh boy, Dad. Um, are you sure about this one? You want to pick this one? Molly, be nice. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we could uh, have some dinner together. Actually, girls, uh, now that you met your stepmom, I have to get going. Get going? Where? I have to do an overnight trip for work, so Haley's gonna stay with you. Wait, what? Haley's gonna stay with us? Here you go, honey. Here's some money. You could get some pizza for the girls and stuff, or maybe you guys could go shopping and do some bonding. Ooh, shopping. Dizzy, are you okay with this? We don't even know this lady. Okay, girls, I love you. Have fun with your new stepmom. Bye! Oh my gosh, Dad left us here with this stranger! Correction, she's our new stepmom, Marley. I don't like this. I don't like it at all. Well, whether you like it or not, you're stuck with me. Now, as your stepmom, I think the first thing we should do is I should watch TV while you girls pick up. This place is trashed. Wait, what? Yeah, don't you have chores and stuff? Let's get to it. Hop, hop! Um, but, but we don't really do chores right now. Well, you're going to do chores right now because I'm in charge. So get out the vacuum and get started, Molly. And Daisy, you can go make some dinner. I'm starving. Oh, M, G! This is, this, this stepmom is evil! Molly, less talking, more vacuuming. Whatever. This is terrible. Oh, how could dad do this? Well, I got a dinner prepared. I hope she likes it. Ugh, what is that? Yuck, that looks disgusting. Try again, Paisy. Her name is Daisy. Why are you calling her Paisy? Oh my gosh. This is the most hated stepmom on the planet. Vacuuming the whole floor. This lady doesn't even know us. She's already bossing us around. Um, can you vacuum under my feet, please? It's kind of dirty. I walked in with dirty shoes. Seriously, you could have taken your shoes off. Hey, um, girls, I'm your mom now, so you need to respect me. Oh, what is that? Turkey legs? Ew. I don't eat turkey. That's disgusting. Try again. Daisy, can I see you in the kitchen for a minute? Sure, Molly. What is it? This lady is crazy. I don't like her. I don't like her. She's the world's most hated stepmom. Yeah, I have to admit, I wanted to give her a shot, but she's just bossing us around like, well... We're just her minions or something. I'm done being this lady's minion. I'm done. Yeah, well, I think I should continue to do this because she is our mom now. I don't think so. You can do what you want, Daisy, but I don't think so. Excuse me, what are you doing? This house is still filthy. If you don't like the way the house looks, you clean it. If you want to be an evil stepmom, well, I'm not going to put up with that. I hear... I made you a cheeseburger, fries, and some soda. Well, that's more like it. Gosh, it took you long enough. Sorry, I don't know you very well, Haley. And, um, I, I didn't know what you wanted to eat. Daisy, seriously, you're still gonna, like, just do everything this lady says? Mm-hmm. She is. Want to know why? Because your dad and I have already gotten secretly married. Wait, what? We weren't even invited to your wedding? Nope. We just, um... Went down to the courthouse and got married. So I'm actually officially and legally your stepmom. Ah! Wake up, Molly. This has got to be a bad dream. This has got to be a bad dream. Nope, it's your reality now, dear. Now, let's see. I want you to uh, also, well, your sister looks like she's mopping. So maybe you could clean out the hot tub. Listen, lady, I don't think so. Okay, then I'll just ground you for, I don't know, 10 years. Now go to your room. Both of you, you're disturbing my my awesome show that I want to watch. But I'm doing what I'm asked. I don't care. If your sister misbehaves, you're going to get punished for it too. Now go to your room. You're both grounded. Thanks, Molly. Well, at least if we go to our room, we don't need to be near this person. She's so rude. I just don't know what to do, Molly. She just seems so mean. And she's the most evil stepmom ever. Daisy, it's going to be okay. Dad'll be home in the morning, and, and hopefully he'll come to his senses. I hope so. Let's just go to bed and pretend this day never happened, if we can even sleep. I hope so, Molly. I have a knot in my stomach. I don't think I'm going to be able to sleep. You want me to sing you a lullaby? Uh, well, uh... da 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 ba ba da 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 Molly, that's not really happening. It's not helping me at all. da 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 Oh, yeah, it's really happening. And it's going to help you, Daisy. Oh, boy. 
I need some earplugs. Girls, girls! Wow, why are you girls sleeping so late? What are you doing? Huh? What? Huh? Dad! It's so good to see you! Oh, how was your first day with Haley? Oh, she's so nice. What? Are you crazy? She's fooled you, Dad! What do you mean she's fooled me? Daisy, what's wrong? You're never sad. You're always happy. What's wrong? I... I have to tell you I'm so sad and I'm also very tired because Molly tried to sing me a lullaby and it was terrible! Hey, I think my singing's amazing. Girls, what's going on? Talk to me. Okay, well, in a nutshell, your uh, new wife, who's our stepmom, is evil! Yeah, she's totally evil. What? Haley? No! Dad, she made us um, do chores, like, all the time. She made me make Oteno. What? I left her money to buy you guys pizza. Well, she didn't. And then she grounded us to our room for ten years. Okay, let's go talk to Haley about this. Okay, well, she'll probably just lie, but we can try. Hey, Haley, um, the girls were telling me some crazy things, and I just wanted to see what you had to say for yourself. What? What are you talking about? I knew it! She's gonna lie! Well, the girls said you made them do a ton of chores and clean the entire house. Uh, yeah, because they're supposed to. Actually, on school nights, they're supposed to do their homework and then get a good night's sleep. Well, I'm their stepmom now, so I get a say in how they're raised, and I think you've made spoiled brats, Dan. Wait, my kids aren't spoiled brats. I mean, Molly's a little crazy sometimes. Dad! Well, it's kind of true, Molly. <laughs> uh, you don't always follow the rules. But my kids are good kids, and they have good hearts. Uh, well, I just think that they need to be grounded for like 10 years because they're super naughty. Seriously, Haley? You're not the person I thought you were. Um, I think we're going to have to get a divorce. Hallelujah! The Wicked Witch is out of our house! What are you talking about? I thought we were in love! And now you're just going to divorce me after like one day of being married? Um, no, it's actually called an annulment, and I'm pretty sure you're not the person I thought you were. Maybe I rushed into things. My girls are the most important things to me in the world, and if you can't be nice to them, well, then we aren't going to work out. Oh, but you had everything! Fine, whatever! I'll just find someone new. Bye! Man, she was the most hated stepmom ever. Yeah, still feeling sad about it. Well, maybe we should go get an ice cream. Yep, that would definitely help. I'm sorry, girls. I guess I picked a bad stepmom. You think so? Holy guacamole. Sometimes grown-ups, they just kill me. <laughs> well, bye, hated stepmom. See you again. Never! Hey, guys. What's up? It's me, Molly. And to be Daisy, and my sister and I are sort of like obsessed with Encanto right now. Daisy, watch this. I'm making flowers grow all around. Whoa, Molly. Well, that's so that you smell better than you normally do. Oh, very funny, Daisy. You could smell beautiful like a Daisy like me. Just because your name is Daisy doesn't mean you smell like a flower. I do, though, Molly. I do. Smell this. <laughs> Molly! <laughs> Um, guys, today we've decided to play Encanto Survive the Killer! Bum, bum, bum! Are you ready for this, Daisy? Totally, Marley. I'm totally ready. Then let's go! Daisy, I think we should just stay ourselves so we can recognize each other. But you can be other characters if you want to be, but I don't know. We won't even know it's us if we don't. Good point, Marley. But maybe we could just buy a dress or something. Um, okay, well, first of all, let's just play around because right now it's saying who the killer is going to be. Who's it going to be? Okay, well, it's not me. All right, so I'm out in the woods camping by the looks of it. Oh, yeah, there's definitely an RV. Someone's, like, driving away with it. Um, and we have to survive the killer. Game over! Somebody quit. That's so annoying when that happens. Hey, if you don't want to be the killer... Don't play the game. That's just rude. All right. Um, well, I think... Can I just buy, like, a dress? 
I don't want to actually be like the character. I want to be myself, but I think you actually have to just be the character. Yeah, you definitely do, Molly. Oh, look, we can have like crazy faces, though. Yeah, you totally can. If you buy the face pack, that is. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get an Encanto face because I think that would be really fun. All right, um, I'm gonna pick this one. Oh, I can't get over there. Whoa, look at my face. All right, killer is coming in 10 seconds. Hide. And I said I was gonna hide over here before. Oh, MG. Okay, I'm gonna climb up this tower. And I hopefully I will not be killed. I'm hoping. No promises, though. Who is the actual killer? What do they look like? Are they Mirabelle? Like, are they just like a monster? I don't know. I don't know. Marley, it's Mirabelle. She's the killer you have to survive. Um, okay. Somehow Daisy knows this. Maybe because she already got killed. Wait, is that her right there? OMG. I'm confused. Like, who? Oh, my God. There she is. I can tell because she has a knife. Oh, my gosh. She's climbing up that tree. She's going to kill you. Be careful. You have to survive the killer. Oh, my gosh. Where's Daisy? You're totally freaking out. Yeah, I know, because I don't want to die. Hello? Don't worry. We'll be safe up here. Thanks, Robloxian82945-8716. That's a very long name. I know. <laughs> my mom gave it to me. Really? Your mom named you Robloxian82945-8716? <laughs> That's cray cray. Okay. Oh, my God. There she is with the knife. See, I think this is the best hiding spot because if you see her coming up here, you can just bail over the side. Is she coming up here? I think maybe I should go over here. This is the farthest away from the steps. And I don't want to die. Whoa. Ah! Game over. Wait a minute. I think it just actually survived. Hooray! Daisy, did you survive? Daisy? Daisy? Yeah, Miley, I was fine. This game's pretty fun, actually. Yeah, totally. Kanto <laughs> survived the killer. Okay, guys, this is so beautiful. Oh, look at the Dolores one. Um, yeah, I, I want to buy this one. Marley, I thought we were staying as we were. Yeah, I know, but I can't help myself. This one's really pretty. Yeah, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Ha, ha, ha. Wait, did I change? I can't say anything. I'm trying to figure out who the killer is. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Okay, I didn't get my outfit. Wait, I paid for it. Oh, my God, the killer is right there. Whoa. I paid for it, and I didn't even get my outfit. That's annoying. All right, that spot was really cool, but hello, guys. They have an RV in here. I'm going to drive it. <laughs> you can't get me because I'm driving the RV, and I will drive it right over you if I have to. Well, you can't really drive it too far. You probably shouldn't drive it into trees either. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, I just ran over somebody. Don't worry, though. The killer had already got him. Wait, is that the killer there? Because I'm starting to feel a little nervous. <laughs> ah! Your face is creepy. Are you the killer? Um, I think she is, but she's just like, coming along for the ride. Um, no, you're not murdering me. Bye. <laughs> ah, she's after me. She can run so much faster than me. How is that even fair? The killer eats less cupcakes than Molly. That's what it means. It means she's in better shape than me. Come on up here. I dare ya. <laughs> you can't catch me. Nah, 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 nah. Okay, I haven't heard from Daisy in a really long time, so I'm just like a little worried about her. But I want another round. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> I was the killer, Molly. Seriously? Daisy? Oh, wow. I love your outfit. Are you done being evil now? Uh, maybe. Whoa, look at my braids. I am gorgeous. Oh my god, you are the killer. Find the hiding players. Oh my gosh, I'm the killer, guys. And I just put on this beautiful outfit. How can I be a killer in this outfit? Oh my gosh. Wait, do I have the knife? Where's the knife? I don't have a knife. I don't have a knife! The knife got taken from me. I just have this angry Mirabelle face. But I have no knife. Okay, um, I don't know what to do about that. I'm gonna have to kill you. I'm very, very sorry. Wait, there's a knife. Okay, can I have that back, please? It like won't let me pick it up. I guess I'm just killing people by touching them. Okay, fine. There's always someone up here. I know, because I hide up there. 
Which means... Oh, I'm going to get stuck. That's what it means. Uh -huh. I'm not going to say I'm the best killer in the world. I'm probably not. Um, okay, no one's up here. Apparently, no one thinks of that hiding spot. And it is literally the best one. Is that somebody's leg over there? Okay, that is creepy. Whoa, is that a s'mores? <gasps> it's a... No, it's someone's arm. <laughs> I thought it was a s'mores, but no. Like marshmallow on a stick to make s'mores, but no, no. It wasn't. Somebody in the tent? Hey, Bell! Here's Mirabel. Okay, why do I not... Oh, there's Daisy! Marty, you can't! I'm your sister! Well, I can't because I'm running into this tent, too, so there's that. Come here, Daisy! Come here! <laughs> Marty! No! Okay, Daisy's dead. Marty, you rude. Sorry, it had to happen. Oh, I didn't kill everybody! It was fun, though. It was fun. Oh, boy. My sister's psycho. Okay, can I go back to being Dolores now? Yes, I can. I feel, like, amazing right now. <laughs> I really do. I just look beautiful. I think I'm going to climb to the top of this tree this time. I don't know who the killer is, but hopefully it's not my sister. Marty, it's me. Ah, are you the killer? Do I look like Mirabelle? No. That I'm not the killer. Well, why are you hiding next to me? Yeah, good point. You're definitely going to attract some attention with that. Look at you. You're like dropping hearts from you. Yeah, I know. And stars, too. I am gorgeous. I am so gorgeous. Oh, boy. She's breaking out into song again. Oh, my gosh. Crazy Psycho Mirabelle is trying to tip over that RV. <laughs> Molly, when you're the kiddo, it's all you can think about. What, lifting and tipping over RVs? Hey, guys, I'm just trying to survive. Well, you shouldn't do it near Molly because she draws a lot of attention with her outfit. That's the point, because I look so beautiful. <laughs> okay, where's the killer? The killer can't find us. The killer has given up. Well, I guess it's easy to survive in Encanto, survive the killer. Not always. Daisy, where are you going? What are you doing, Daisy? Come back here! Um, Molly, the game is over. We win. Whoa! Yes! Okay, I am very good at Encanto, survive the killer. <laughs> Guys, if you want to see more Encanto Roblox videos, let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe, guys! Yep, and slam that like button. I know it's a lot to ask, but you guys are amazing fans, so I know you're up for the job. That's right, guys. Thanks so much for watching our video. You're the best fans in the whole world. That's right. See you guys next time. Bye! Oh my gosh, I'm totally gonna be late for school now. Ugh, this is so bad. Oh, I'm really hungry. I think the first thing I should do is go into the kitchen and make breakfast because I am starving. Then I'll take a bath afterwards because seriously, I'm too hungry to wait. Okay, no, I don't want hot dogs for breakfast. Ew. Bacon and eggs, that sounds pretty good to me. All right, let's go over and start making them. Turn on the stove, put in the bacon and eggs. Ooh, they smell delicious. I really am like super hungry. <laughs> I'm starving. I knew I should have had a snack before I went to bed last night. Because I haven't eaten since like dinner and I'm yesterday and I'm just so hungry. Oh, hurry up and cook. You smell so delicious. I want to eat you. Seriously. A little salt and pepper. Ah, perfect. Time to go eat. Hi, gingerbread man. Good morning. Okay, apparently I have to be standing up in order to place something on the table. Kind of silly if you ask me. Ah, time to eat. Oh my gosh. Ah, I just want to eat my breakfast and like Bloxburg is being ridiculous right now. 
Okay. Finally. Yum 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 yum. Ah, so delicious. I'm still hungry. I need another portion. Yum 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 yum. Mmm. Bacon, eggs, delicious. Okay, I'm seriously full now. Ugh, I can barely walk. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna go in and take a bath and brush my teeth and stuff, cause you know we can't have funky teeth. When you're going to school. Brush a brush a brush a brush a brush a brush. Brush a brush a brush a brush a brush a brush. Ah, clean minty teeth. Now I'm going to go take a bath. Because you don't want to be stinky for school. I want to turn on. Okay, here we go. Ah, that's better. Whoa, look at what time it is. I better go see if I got my homework done. Uh-oh. I'm not quite sure that I actually did my homework. Uh, I better work on that right now. Let's see. Spelling. Oh, that's easy. C-A-T. How do you spell unicorn? U-N-I-C-O-R-N. Unicorn. Okay, how do you spell... Hey, did I just hear somebody knocking at the door? Ugh. I wonder who that could be. I have to go to school soon. I hope it's not like Bookie Cookie because, like, we can't play right now. We have to go to school. Ah, oh, it's Sarah! What is she doing here? Um, sorry, nobody's home. Whatever, Molly. I saw you in there. That is so rude. Open the door. Ah, oh, no, you didn't see anybody. It was just a ghost. Just a ghost, Sarah. Nobody's there. <laughs> Molly, seriously, I know you're in there. Open the door right now. I'm not going to stop knocking. Ah, oh, fine. What do you want, Sarah? I want to come into your house. Duh. Um, no, you can't come into my house. Goodbye. Molly, I'm going to tell your mom. Seriously, you're going to be a tattletale? Fine, come on. What do you want? Well, I wanted to tell you that today we're having a party at school. A party? What? No one told me about a party. Well, I'm telling you about it because I'm the head of the party. You and head of a party? I don't think you'd ever be in charge of a party. What are you talking about? Uh, I'm nothing. It's just that you're not very fun. Molly, rude. Okay. Uh, yeah, that was a little rude. Sorry. Anyway, do you want to know what you have to do for the party so that you can come? Uh, yeah, okay. What is it? It's an ugly sweater um, Christmas party. What? That sounds like so much fun. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm totally serious. Make sure you show up today at school with your ugly Christmas sweater or you won't be able to come into the party. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks so much, Sarah. Okay, well, you have to get out now because I have to change into my sweater. Okay, Molly. Well, I'll see you at school. Don't be late and wear the ugliest sweater that you can. Okay, well, thanks, Sarah. Wow, Sarah actually wasn't mean for a change. That's strange. Okay, I better go into my closet and find an ugly Christmas sweater. Wait a minute. I don't think I have one. I think I'll have to borrow Daisy's. She won't mind. She's in a dance um, competition right now. Okay, let's see. I know exactly what I want to wear. It's going to be perfect. Oh, hey, Maya. Um, hi, Molly. Um, what are you wearing? <laughs> Uh, an ugly Christmas sweater for the ugly Christmas sweater party today? Um, <laughs> Molly, I hate to tell you this, but, um, yeah, you look ridiculous. But Maya, I, I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, I did what everyone said to do. Um, okay, Molly, whatever. Uh, I have to get to class. Okay, well, see you later, Maya. Oh, hey there, B. Um, Molly, what are you wearing? <laughs> <laughs> you look so funny. Uh, I'm wearing my ugly Christmas sweater for the ugly Christmas sweater party. Um, Molly, I don't think there's an ugly Christmas sweater party today. What? No, no, that's not true. Sarah told me there was. Um, no, Molly. Um, and I have to go because I have fishing class now. Uh, okay, but I think you're going to be sad that you didn't wear an ugly Christmas sweater. No, definitely not, Molly. Definitely not. Hey, Nicole.
Nicole, where's your ugly Christmas sweater? Um, who are you? Oh, it's you, Molly! <laughs> you look so funny today! Why are you wearing that? Um, because I thought there was an ugly Christmas sweater party? <laughs> who told you that, Molly? Oh, no! Oh, oh man! Oh, I can't believe she tricked me again! I'm gonna go hide in the bathroom. At least nobody will find me in here in my silly sweater. Ugh, I feel so ridiculous. Now I'm wearing this silly looking Rudolph sweater with with buck teeth and and it I just the sweater's itchy and it's just a horrible day. Ugh, maybe no one will find me in here. Hello? Is anybody out there? No? Okay, good. That means I can just keep hiding in the bathroom. Oh, I don't know why Sarah is so mean to me. Why does she always be mean to me? Oh, it's so horrible. I mean, now I'm going to be embarrassed because I'm wearing this ugly Christmas sweater all day. Molly, is that you that I hear in there? Oh, no. She's here. She found me. Molly, is that you? Uh, no. It's, it's not me. Um, Molly, I can totally tell that's you. No, no, it's not Molly. It's, um, it's not Molly. Molly, I'm coming in there. No, you're not. Get out. What are you doing? <laughs> Your sweater is so ugly. You look ugly. Hey, that's not nice, Sarah. Well, I'm just telling you that you totally look ugly in that sweater. <laughs> this was the best prank that I ever pulled. Seriously, you told me that there was a Christmas sweater party today for ugly Christmas sweaters, and I wore one, and there's no party, is there? Um, no, that was part of the prank. <laughs> and you totally fell for it. Yeah, because I'm actually a nice person, and you are not. What are you talking about? I'm totally nice. I just said that your sweater was ugly. That's not mean. Uh, yeah, it is, Sarah. Now go away. Are you really going to go out of here wearing that silly sweater in front of everybody at the school? Well, you know what, Sarah? I'd rather be in a silly sweater than, than to have that, that grumpy, mean mean personality that you have because you know what i can change my sweater but you can't change how mean you are well you kind of can but you don't want to so that just makes you totally horrible what are you seriously talking to me the popular girl like that yeah i am now go away sarah i'm just gonna go to class wearing my ugly christmas sweater if somebody laughs it's okay because it's like you know i'll just i'll just own it I'll be like, yeah, I wore an ugly Christmas sweater. Why didn't you wear one? What's wrong with you? You didn't want to wear an ugly Christmas sweater? Where is everybody? I don't even know what class I'm supposed to be in right now. Okay, no. Is everybody in our class? I don't even know. Uh -huh, there's a student, but she's sleeping. Hey, can I sit next to you? Oh, this is perfect. They won't even know that I'm... I'm, like, wearing this ugly Christmas sweater because, look. Oh, there you are, Molly. I'm going to paint your ugly Christmas sweater for everybody in the class to see. I'm writing your name first. Molly looks ugly. Sarah, I'm going to tell the teacher, go away. Ugh. Can you believe this girl? Uh, Sarah, I don't think you should be sleeping in our class. That's totally naughty. Uh, Sarah, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Uh, okay. Gonna sleep through our class, I guess. Look at your ugly Christmas sweater. <laughs> whatever, Sarah, whatever. I didn't want to go to our class today anyway. I'll just hang out in the library and read a book. What? All the books are gone! Holy moly! Can't believe everybody checked out all of the books. That's crazy. I have to escape. Whoa, why is the glass broken in here? Oh my gosh, you can't go in that room. 
I don't know why, don't ask me. I'm like literally trying to find a class that Sarah doesn't know I'm in. Okay, shh, she's coming. She's coming, shh, don't tell her I'm in here. Molly, where are you? Oh my gosh, run! Okay, maybe I'll go into history class. Nobody will be in there. I can just hide in my ugly sweater all by myself. Molly, where are you? Oh, no. Maybe I should just walk by. Molly? Come on, I want to see your ugly Christmas sweater some more. Molly? Oh, my gosh, run! Where is everybody? They must be at recess. <gasps> can I go in here? Maybe I can hide in here. She won't see me back here. Molly, where are you? Molly! Uh, where did she go? I want to tease her some more. Can't even find her. <gasps> there you are! Ah! Oh my gosh, why do you keep bothering me? Go away! Is it not enough that I wore this silly sweater? And now you have to just make fun of me all day? Get out of here! Okay, somebody else help me. Who was that? Another student? Hi! Hi, um, can you help me? She's totally bullying me right now. Oh my gosh, really, Molly? I'm so sorry to hear that. Sarah, stop being mean. Whatever. I mean, look at her sweater. It looks ridiculous. Here, let's paint it a different color. Get out of here! Oh my gosh, I have to call my mom and go home. She's going to come pick me up. I just know it when I tell her what happened. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can run faster than Sarah. Huh, huh, huh. She's super fast. I know, I saw her at gym class last week. Excuse me, um, Principal Keys, I need to talk to you for a minute. Sure, Marley, what is it? What can I help you with? Um, help, something's wrong. What's going on? Um, okay, never mind. You don't want to tell me? No, not really. I just, I don't, I don't know. It's okay, Molly. You could totally tell me what's going on. Okay. Um, well, Sarah's bullying me about this Christmas sweater I wore. Oh, I see. Were you trying to wear an ugly Christmas sweater? Yeah, she told me that basically um, there was a party today, even though there wasn't. Oh, well, I think your sweater's pretty cute. I do, too. I mean, it's supposed to be ugly, but I think it's adorable. But she keeps saying it's uh, totally ugly. No, Molly, that's not true. Don't let haters get to you. Okay, I'll try not to. And in the meantime, I'll have a talk with Sarah and tell her not to bully other students. Speaking of Sarah... Oh, there you are, Molly. Sarah, I think we need to talk. Uh, Principal Keys, I'm kind of busy right now. Sarah, have you been picking on Molly's uh Christmas sweater? Me? No, never. Liar! Sarah, I would like you to stop doing that, please. Um, okay, whatever. Ah, oh, finally! Principal Keys took care of this problem, and now I can wear my reindeer sweater all I want! <laughs> hey, Toy Hero fans! Thanks so much for watching our role play today in Bloxburg and in Roblox High. Don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel for awesome videos like this one every single day! We'll see you guys next time! Bye! Woohoo! Today's a beautiful day! Really? Who are you and what'd you do with my sister Molly? What do you mean, Daisy? It's, it's me, Molly. No, it's not! You're an alien! I just know it! Uh, nope. That's definitely Molly. No, I don't think it is Molly. <laughs> She's never in that good of a mood about coming to daycare. Well, I am today! I don't know who you are, but you're not my sister. Daisy, yes, I am your sister. I'm not an alien. I'm just in a good mood today. Really? You always say, I'm going to high school. I'm not going to daycare. Well, today I'm super excited because it's fall. Look at all the trees. They look so beautiful. They're all different colors. And it's nice and cool outside. It's not so hot. It's been so hot where I live in Texas. It really has been like a million degrees. Yeah, it really has. Yeah, I'm so glad that it's over being so hot. Me too. See, there's lots of reasons to be in a good mood. But the biggest one is... Dun, 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 dun. It's almost Halloween. It's almost Halloween. Ooh, yeah, you're right. What are you going to be for Halloween? I think you're going to be a cat because I already see your cat ears. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking about it. What about you, Daisy? Uh, never tell. 
It's a secret. Did you guys look both ways? Ah, get out of the road! There's cars coming! Come on, Molly. We have to get in here. We don't want to miss breakfast. Oh, yeah. I forgot they give you breakfast here. Oh, daycare is not so bad. Whoa, look at this. This looks delicious. Breakfast pizza! My favorite! Mm, pizza. And what else do they have? Good morning! Uh, good morning, uh, cafeteria lady. Uh, it's really nice of you to, to give us breakfast pizza today. Oh, I'm so glad you're excited about it. I worked really hard. I stayed up all night making it. Whoa! You're a really dedicated cafeteria lady. <laughs> You work all night. That's just crazy. Okay, I also have... Why is it saying chicken? No, I want milk. Oh, no, no, I have two chickens! Um, maybe you should get some sleep because, um, you made chicken for breakfast. Ew. So, Daisy, you're not going to tell anybody what you're going to be for Halloween? Dad, yeah! Well, Molly, are you going to tell us what you're going to be? I think I'm going to be... Get this, guys. A mummy! Molly, how you gonna be a mummy? Where you gonna get all the wraps from? I'm just gonna use toilet paper. <laughs> you gonna wrap yourself in toilet paper? Yeah, I think it'll work really good. Well, I do think Molly has a point. It is gonna work pretty good. She will look like a mummy. But what if it rains? All the toilet paper will melt. Oh yeah, I hope it doesn't rain. <laughs> That'd be bad. Look, guys, we beat the bus today. It says time to go home. I think that might be wrong. Yeah. Ugh. Well, we could go home. Don't worry, Molly. Mm. Chicken for breakfast is not that bad. Oh, Buado. <laughs> that sounds gross. The breakfast pizza is delicious, though. I couldn't agree more. Ah. Now I've had two breakfasts. Are you serious, Molly? You seriously um, had breakfast at home and now you're having breakfast here? Yeah. Hey, look, guys. It's the monthly home store. They always do this at daycare where you can come in once a month and buy stuff. Mm, no. No. Ooh, look at that one. It sort of looks like Chucky. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That totally does look like Chucky. I'm not going to buy anything from the home store just because, right, like today, because I'm wearing this adorable pumpkin shirt. It is so cute. I'm thinking, though, that I probably shouldn't have wore shorts because it's a little chilly out today. Oopsie, but it'll be okay because I'm going to run around a lot, so. Ugh, I'm not feeling so good. Brookie, are you okay? I don't know. Ugh, my stomach just kind of hurts. No, I'm sure you're fine. No, I'm really, I'm really, oh, I think I'm gonna throw up. Oh, Brookie! Oh, no. Maybe something she ate. Anyway, I don't, did we eat the same things? Nah. Molly, look at all these adorable outfits. Yeah, they're adorable, except for this one looks like the Chucky doll. Ooh, creepy. Yeah, it does. I like my boo outfit. You mean your prison outfit? Jailbreak outfit, jailbreak outfit. Molly, don't tease me. Mom said you'll get um, detention. Yeah, okay. It's cute, but it does look a little bit like the jailbreak prisoner outfits. No, because it says boo on it. Now, come on. We better get to class. There's a cooking class happening. Ugh, my stomach kind of hurts. Oh, no, not you, kitty cat. That's what I'm calling you because you're wearing cat ears. Yeah, ugh, my stomach is just hurting. What's this all about? I don't know why we all jumped here, but I did it too. Daisy? Oh, I'm going to check on Brookie. Brookie? Brookie, are you okay? No, I'm laying down in the magic cot. I don't feel good. Oh my goodness, Brookie! I don't know, Molly, but my stomach is hurting me right now. Oh, Daisy, you're fine. Come on. We have to get to class. No, seriously, Molly. My tummy is really, really hurting. Daisy, I think you just feel like sympathy pains for Brookie Cookie. Come on. Computer lab, music lab, art. Another computer lab. Where is everybody? I don't know, Molly. Maybe they're down here, guys. Okay, but... I'm not sure really what's going on right now. Hey, look at this. There's there's a sign on the wall. 
What's it say? It says, it says that, it says that everybody is out sick. What? No, there's somebody right there. And there's a teacher. Um, Molly, no, I think everybody has the stomach bug. What? Yeah, apparently, um, uh, apparently everybody basically uh, stayed home today, but we didn't get the memo. Oh, my gosh. And I really don't feel good, Molly. I have to go to the nurse. Daisy! Oh, am I the only one that didn't get the stomach bug today? Yes, I am. Huh. An elevator? Seriously? Am I on the first floor now? Well, I guess I got the whole school to myself. Because everybody else is home from school. And um, the people that I came with are in the nurse's office. So what will I do? What? Oh! Oh my gosh! If you try to go behind the teacher's desk or the administration's desk. Oh my gosh. It kills you. I'm new here today. Um... Do you like this daycare? Yeah, it's okay, but you should call your mom and go back home. Why? Because everybody got the stomach flu at my school, and basically, if you come in here, you'll get it too. I've already been exposed to it, so I'm just going to go back in. Okay, well, thank you. I'll think about that. You better. You don't want the stomach bug. Ugh. My tummy kind of hurts. Eh, it's probably that chicken I had for breakfast. Do, 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 do. Oh my gosh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> Excuse me. Now I feel better. I'm gonna go check on my friends. Brookie? Where'd they go? Okay, maybe I'm in the wrong room. <laughs> Don't panic. There's Brookie. Oh, I can't wait till my mom gets here. Oh, I feel so sick. I don't know what everybody's talking about. I feel flat. Oh, my stomach kind of hurts. Oh, oh, no, Molly. You got the stomach bug, too. Daisy, where are you? I don't even see you, Daisy. Daisy's a ghost. Oh, my gosh. Where is Daisy? I'm not a ghost, Molly. I'm right here. Oh, Daisy, I don't feel good either. Well, you can't have my magic cat. This one's mine. Oh, tell the school nurse to call our moms. I already did, Molly. I already did. Oh, no. I'm going to have to lay on the magic cot. Oh. Oh, I don't feel good. Oh, my gosh. You weren't lying. Everybody does have the stomach flu. I got to get out of here. I wasn't lying. I told you. Oh. Oh. The stomach flu. Oh. Molly, are you just faking so you don't have to stay at daycare? Yeah, right. Uh, that'll teach me for eating chicken for breakfast.